Good morning, N10. It's Miss Ortiz going to be doing news to you with this with you guys this morning. So let's go ahead and review world news. We have one um, story to read this morning. It's about McDonald's. It says McDonald's restaurants want to thank the people who work to how um, to keep others safe and healthy. From April 22nd until May 5th, McDonald's is offering free thank you meals to first responders and healthcare workers. First responders include police officers, firefighters, and paramedics. Healthcare workers include doctors, nurses, therapists, and aides. The thank you meals are available during breakfast, lunch, and dinner. First responders and healthcare workers can show their badges or wear their uniforms to receive one free meal. Each meal is served in a Happy Meal box and includes a thank you note. Pretty cool. Awesome. Good job, McDonald's. All right, next category, sports news. We have Ron Gronkowski returns to the NFL. Ron Gronkowski is coming out of retirement to return to the NFL. Ron is a football player who played for the New England Patriots NFL team uh, for nine seasons. He retired just last year. However, he decided recently he wants to play again. Now Ron will play for a new team. He announced April 21st he joined the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Another former Patriots player, Tom Brady, recently announced he was joining the Buccaneers too. NFL season is scheduled to start on September the 10th, but the coronavirus could delay the season. Guess we'll have to see if there's football um, in September or not. All right, let's see. Sports news. We have one more. NFL draft pick. It says the 2020 NFL draft is April 23rd to the 25th, which was last week. The NFL football teams pick new football players during the draft. Cincinnati Bengals had the first pick. They picked Joe Burrow, a quarterback from the Louisiana State Tigers college football team. Joe Burrow won the Heisman Trophy last year. Heisman Trophy is an award given to the best college football player each year. Joe Burrow is an amazing football player. Usually the draft takes place in a city and Joe would have been invited to come. However, because of the coronavirus, it was online and he was home with his family. Congratulations, Joe. Pretty cool. He was number one. All right. And I think we have one more category and it is entertainment news. I'm going to try to do this quickly because I guess we have a timer and um, don't want to run out of time. All right, American Idol news. Popular TV show American Idol has four more episodes. The next episode is April the 26th. Singer compete on American Idol. Usually they compete, the contestants perform on a stage in front of an audience. This year they are performing from home because of the coronavirus. The 20 singers will film their performances on smartphones. Judges will talk about their favorite singer from their homes. The audience will watch on TV and they get to vote for their favorite singer. 10 singers move on to the second episode. The winner will be announced May 17th. Anybody in here American Idol fans? Anybody? Anybody? All right, we have one more story. It's the Kids Choice Award Show. Do any of you guys watch it? it says the Kids Choice Award Show is May 2nd, which is I think uh, soon, this weekend. The award show was delayed because of the coronavirus. This year, celebrities will present and accept awards from their homes. Some celebrities will get slimed. Ooh. The award show is called Nickelodeon's Kids' Choice Award 2020. Celebrate together. The award show honors kids' favorites in many categories. Kids voted for their favorite TV show, movie, superhero, singer, video game, athlete, and more before the show. The winner will be announced on the show. Many kids will watch the Kids Choice Award show on TV. Will you watch the Kids Choice Award? Anybody, anybody? All right, you guys. Well, time is up. I hope you guys are all doing good. Um, don't forget to check YouTube regularly for any new videos posted. If you have any questions, text me, call me. Have a good day, you guys. Bye.